My beautiful subjects, today I want to put you guys into a movie called Kajillionaire. First things first, the way that Melanie naturally flirts with old Dolio gives me all the butterflies. You must be the refrigerator repair person. I bet you meet a lot of lonely women when you're out in the field repairing refrigerators. During a desperate heist, they charm a stranger, Gina Rodriguez, into joining them, only to have the entire world turn upside down. Housewives must be throwing themselves at you, huh? You know, if you need tools, we have tools. The movie tells a story of two con artists that have spent 26 years training their only daughter to trick, scam, and steal at every turn. What about my plan? I mean, was Your that just... plan to cash in on the generosity of lonely people? Hey! Ow! You knocked off my nail. Let's be honest, even Rachel Wood essentially removing the long acrylic nails from Gina Rodriguez's fingers is the single most homosexual act I have seen on the big screen in a really long time. I have a suggestion for you. What? Wear more clothes. You're making everybody feel uncomfortable. Old Dolio's strong, silence type doesn't give away any indication that she has ever necessarily considered gender or sexuality. It is simply through the course of the events within the film that she and Melanie are drawn to each other. One thousand. $575 to call me, hon. It's one word, just say it. I'll do it. I'll call you, hon, for $1,575. A refreshing take on queer romance in cinema that feels completely natural to the plot. The film is amazing, and the beauty of accepting the love we have always deserved but we never got is beyond beautiful. Oh, hon. My sweetheart. My sweet baby. The film is fun, spicy, refreshing, heartfelt, and visually stunning. And it is a much needed film to add to your queer movie list. Honestly, I think every scene was better than the previous one, and I cannot emphasize how every part of this film felt like it was done for the gays. Well, and this is a little different because they're my parents. In what sense? What? In what sense are they your parents? What's an example? It is so rare to see this sort of queer hero. The film is strange and refreshingly unique that will leave you with that happy, longing feeling in the end. I hope you enjoyed today's video and thank you so much for watching.